Hello and welcome. Here is the cast you love, the people you trust. This is StationX.TV. Our goal is to teach you something on every episode. Sit tight, relax, and enjoy the show. Okay, welcome to this video. In this video, I'm going to show you how to download and install VirtualBox. Um, it's a VirtualBox is a product that you can use to create virtual images, uh, virtual machines. Um, so to do that, let's go ahead and start by going to your favorite browser. I'm going to use Google Chrome. And once you open your browser, just type uh, on your search criteria, type uh, virtual. So this is the first screen, uh, the first uh, results, and then just click on download Oracle Virtual Box. In here, uh, you have this option to download four different um, operation system. We're gonna use Windows because that's um, what this uh, video is about on how to install Virtual Box in Windows. You click on that and then start download automatically. When it completes downloading, you can either click here to start installing. And this is normally that's how I do it. Um, but if it's not, if you don't want to do it that way, you can click. Uh, you can open your uh, Explorer, go to your downloads, and you will see your downloads right there. And you just double click on it. Um, I'm going to close all of this so we have this uh, Windows clean. Just say run. Close that so we can have a clean. Alright, so this is, you got the welcome screen, just click next. I'm going to use all the default settings over here. I'm not going to change anything. Just click next. If you want to change the location where you want to install, uh, you can click on browse and then pick a different folder where you want. We wanted to install VirtualBox. I'm going to keep the default programs fine. It's, it's uh, fine for the installation. Also here, I'm going to keep the default. If you want to, you can uncheck um, any options over here, but I'm going to keep the default. Just click Next. On this warning screen over here, um, it says the installer uh, or uh, the Oracle VirtualBox network feature will reset your network connection and temporarily disconnect you from the network. It's just like a warning. You're just not gonna. You're not gonna even see any impact. Just say yes uh, for that one, and then click install. And on this uh, screen is gonna appear uh, because um, Windows is saying that uh, the Oracle VirtualBox wanted to make a change to your device. Um, we just say yes because this is verified, trusted, and we. We know it's a good program you can say yes to allow it that to make the change to your device so this installed you're probably gonna get one more um, pop-up uh, which is uh, talking about the Oracle Corporation Universal Serial Bus let's go ahead and allow that to install and always trust and click install so the installation can continue once this installation is done uh, we're gonna be you're gonna get to this screen What's well, going to say start Oracle uh, VM VirtualBox? Uh, that's the version numbering right there. Uh, I'm going to click don't start and just going to click finish. All right, so this VirtualBox is already installed. And if you want to launch VirtualBox, there is a shortcut on your desktop, one of the options that we did not remove. You can double click on it and it's going to load VirtualBox for you. And, all right, it's here. So this is VirtualBox. That's it for today. I hope you enjoyed, and please make sure to subscribe and give a thumbs up or down. Like a wise man once said, speak good or speak evil. No matter, as long as you are speaking of me. Until next time, thank you for tuning in to StationX.TV.